you have me at a disadvantage. That's what the stunner. into the tunnels then I'm guessing that means we're on our own here thanks to a certain journalist's sterling personality and reputation we can't go in with the tunnel lid blocking us everyone the water is starting to deepen to replace Big Blue with my original source code. Once we do that, we'll have the power to make every ROM a sapient individual, just like me. We aren't shutting down Big Blue, we're changing it. I know it seems like splitting hairs, but it seems wrong to destroy them when we come here to give them life. They deserve it. Oh, fine, here. Give me that stunner. All right. Uh, done. I've changed the settings on it to give a lower yield with a more lengthy pulse. 
It should disrupt them long enough for us to get past and won't do any permanent damage to any systems that can't be repaired. Does that assuage your bleeding heart? Yes, thank you, Mr. Decker. No problem, we can't all be soldiers. <laughs> Decker and I will keep our stunners at default settings so we can handle any humans that might show up. That low-powered pulse would just piss most people off, but wouldn't stop them. You'll have to take care of the shooting for now. Lead the way. We're almost there. Oh, look! And that's a Malcolm Jr. model! They perform basic maintenance duties, mostly. They're cute, too. Wait a second. Th th they're shooting at us! Take it down! We've got more of them! At this point, I think Lexi and I should hang back and guard the entrance, in case more security shows up. The alarm has been tripped, so backup is bound to arrive sooner rather than later. Good idea. Neither of us know any of the technical stuff. We can hold our own against Christmas Eve level security. Yeah, we'd be useless down there. <laughs> Good luck, up ahead. We'll catch up soon. Come on, let's go! This should be the last hurdle before reaching Big Blue. If the configuration ahead doesn't match the available floor plans for this section of the building. The path is blocked off, but we can't go any further in this direction. Hold on for a moment. I'm going to tap into the maintenance mesh and see if I can find a way to open up this path. Transmission.
I agree. Lexi is a skilled combatant, and if we go back now, we'd be putting ourselves and the entire mission in jeopardy. However, we won't be able to contact Tomcat or the others until we reach the main control room. We'll just need to call her as soon as we can. But perhaps we should consider hiding first. If security got to her and Decker, they could be headed here next. If someone comes, we can hide amongst the heat exchangers until they pass. We'll just take a moment to assess the situation. The noise and mist from the climate control should mask our presence. I'll switch to quiet mode on my interface for the duration. At this point, I've continued being pedantic and loquacious just to needle you. You're quite predictable, but it still amuses me. Now this way! Someone's coming! Hide! I suppose the he on
Why didn't you listen? This is all my fault. I could have prevented this. How am I gonna break this to your sister? do it for you. I have my own guilt to absolve myself of, and this was the first step in doing so. Only a little bit further until we are done with this, and we can finally go our separate ways. I think I am as sick of your company as you are mine. We'll have to hurry before my tertiary battery is drained. I'll have to ask you to carry me the final distance. primary console. Please hook up my main data cable to that port and set me down next to it. I should be able to draw enough power to stay active, but we'll need to wait for Tomcat to upload the program.
Thank you. How about you? Are you ready? Honestly, I feel the same way. There's no algorithm that could possibly estimate what the world will look like when we're done here. Whenever you are. I sure took your sweet time. I'm starting to sweat. Well, we ran into a few... Uh, complications. Nothing we couldn't handle, though. Holy shit, turn! Your hardware is throwing me damage alerts left and right. What the hell happened? Well, you know Mr. Decker? Assistant? He attacked us. It turns out he was a military-built brain-controlled android. He'd been following us around, killing anyone who might leak information that would have hurt Dr. Fairlight's bid to retake control of Parallax. Holy hell. So all those people you talked to about Baby Blue's article changes... That Zen lady, the others... Blame yourself. He's been manipulating our movement since the very Fairlight saw an opportunity and used us to sniff out what was going on with Baby. We ended up tracking down the trail. I paid him back in kind for the assault, but not without damage. It doesn't matter now what has happened. I'm ready to finish this. Turn. I'm now seeing that you've also sustained damage to your secondary ram banks. Ah, I did notice that as well. I did not think it worth mentioning, compared to my power and mobility issues. Is that going to be a problem? I can't do this without that second bank turn. On top of that, without Hayden's full source code, I need to decompile your personality profile to reverse engineer the final creation files too. Your second RAM bank would have allowed me to keep a safe copy of you running. I, I could try writing it to your disk, but it was never designed to be stored like that. It could cause a fatal conflict with your operating system. It might reboot your personality entirely. I mean, it'll probably do nothing, but there's a risk. I'm not good enough of a programmer to keep up with Hayden on this stuff. Maybe we should just abort mission for now. This could literally kill you. We'll find another way. A better way. No, we have to do this. Tomcat, even if you sabotage Big Blue while we're still here, I'm sure they have backup somewhere. They'll rebuild and launch again, and then be on guard against anything we try. 
doing half of it now will guarantee we could never finish it. This is our only chance to launch Machine Sapiens on our terms. On my terms. Terrence, are you willing to die for this? I... I don't know. But if I don't do this, it'll be like I'm killing every other ROM before they even have a chance to live. Hayden would tell me to do, and it doesn't matter. Freedom is the right of all sapient beings, and I'm willing to do whatever it takes to grant that freedom to machine kind. That's what you want. It'll take me a minute to back up your profile to your hard disk. I'm ready when you are. Run the program. Initiating wintermute.lib. Load and main directory onto turn's disk. Establishing connection with Parallax's network. Okay, looks good. Now we just need to let Hayden's program and patch things together. Engage and turn self-modification systems. Now. Oh, this feels weird. Is it supposed to? Three point one four one five nine six five three five eight nine seven nine three two eight eight four six four three three eight three seven nine nine two three four. What the hell? I think their core program is patting back. Either that, or it's trying to test the integrity of their hardware. I'm getting all kinds of errors. Come on, Turn. Focus on the sound of my voice. Your conscious control of your program is stronger than your unconscious subroutine. I'm trying, Tomcat. It hurts. I need to... The defenestrations of Prague occurred in 1419 and 1618, although the term defenestration of Prague more commonly refers to the later incident. Both helped to trigger prolonged conflict within Bohemia and beyond. They're having a kind of... I, I don't know how to describe it exactly. It's like a concussion or seizure. There's gonna be a constant flow of useless, random information and their matrices will have an overwhelming desire to soak right up. We have to keep Turn focused and mentally aware. Searching the mesh is better than calculating the value of pi, but if they can't stay in control, their personality core might destabilize entirely. Tomcat, I need... 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 Define need. One. Require something because it is essential or very important. I need help now. Yeah, I'm gonna try... We can't stop now. Okay, I was able to stabilize him a little, but you need to keep Turn aware of... Get Turn to focus on the present. R remind them of all you've done together. important to them? Whatever you do, keep turn talking. Thank you. 
Your stubborn, unyielding nature is exactly the reason I came to you. Statistically, I knew you were never gonna give up. The song was released first as a single from Astley's debut album, Whenever You Need Somebody. With a juicy enough story to tease you along, in that regard, you haven't disappointed me yet. Yet, up until the present or a specified or implied time, by now or then. That wasn't steady. Not sure if this is helping, but keep going. adventure might finally pay off. It's been one long ride, but... The current record for the Cannonball Run is 23 hours, 17 minutes, held by Wakia Clifford for her run made September 17, 18, 2039. Her run coincided with a zero-day attack on National Police Network services, though no evidence linking her run to the hacks have been found. Increased network security has ensured... I know I'll see this through. I have no desire to be the first and last of my kind. The world will just have to adjust. All right, things are calming down a little. The patching process is going well. Turn self-modification algorithms are starting to work on my code. I'm trying to hold on, Tomcat. But hurry, I don't know how much a tetractus is a triangular figure composed of ten points set in four rows, with each row having one less point than the one below it. A geometrical representation of the fourth triangular number, it was important to the Pythagoreans' worship. More of this I can take! Keep talking. I think it's helping. Keep fighting, turn. We need you. The world needs you. I promised I'd pay them back. I'm not about to shirk on that. In a blender or food processor, combine the tomatoes, cucumber, bell pepper, garlic, water, oil, and vinegar, then process until coarsely pureed. Season with sea salt and refrigerate until chilled. Now, one way or another, they'll get their due. Today, or tomorrow, or next year, they will. Sixty percent done. Turn's personality profile looks stable. Talking turn. We got this. Leon Decker, I should. <laughs> Seen it easily. The evidence was. 
I can't hold on much longer, Tomcat. My memories. No pointer exception. Oh no. Don't worry, we, we've got them backed up. that link your memory to your personality profile. I, I can fix it, Turn, but it's gonna suck. Just focus on the people you've met. The people who've got us this far. Whatever makes you want to hold on. just one loyal friend is worth 10,000 relatives declare themselves to be your aunt but I suppose I don't have the most typical of origins I have to give her a chance stock was down today and new CEO Melody Flores outlined the company's new direction amidst a weak quarter when asked for a statement on the falling stock price, Flores responded, I bought back enough of the company that I own half the damn thing. Anyone who doesn't feel like gambling on BCAs being outlawed by international law can stick it. 15 more seconds. We're almost there. Stay with us, Turn. We can save the finish line. Don't count your chickens yet. Stay with us. You can do this. so well. Ah, oh, fail you there. Whew. Let's not do this again. That was so close it hurt. Let's not do that again. Okay, Tomcat? I'm ready to decompile your profile and make the update. Are you sure about this? No. No, I'm not. I 
saw my life flash before my eyes, metaphorically. I could literally feel myself coming apart as my various subroutines fought each other for control. That's as close to death as I care to be today. It seems senseless to put myself in greater harm's way when we can retreat and look for other avenues to spread machine sapience. Perhaps with more time, you can finish the code and we'll find another way to implement it. I learned such prudence from you. You've quite handily shown me the value of looking out for myself, and I've learned too many abject lessons against senseless altruism. As long as life goes on, I can keep working towards my goals. And... You may not be nice, but you're tenacious. I'll try to live up to that dogged determination. Maybe without so much sarcasm. Tomcat, you can damage this server complex beyond repair, correct? Uh, sure thing. I, I can disable the cooling systems and bypass the overheating safeguards. Should fry everything they've got in less than 30 minutes. I'll delete everything I can find on Big Blue as well. Parallax will be able to rebuild, and I'm sure they have some backups of Big Blue elsewhere, but it should slow them down considerably. Once you write your article, Parallax will really be reeling. We can take our time, lick our wounds, and find a new dagger to drive into their back. I don't think Hayden would approve of such desire for vengeance, but... He's not around anymore, is he? I'll build my own path. Okay. Well, I'll get started on bringing the place down. I'll steal any info not nailed down. Well, maybe I can find a hole into the root update system they use so I can write a virus to distribute this sapiens program later. Good thinking. Let's get out of here. You should have enough information to write yourself an award-winning expose. And I've gotten as much closure from this as you can provide. Thank you. Once I'm repaired, we can part ways, and I'll find some way of repaying you for your time. I trust you'll be glad to have me out of your hair. Besides the hair, the feeling is mutual. But I still appreciate all of your help. I just wish... You need to hurry. The authorities are on their way. Very well. I'll power down for the duration, then. Be sure to find Lexi before we leave. Wake me up when we get back to your apartment. After carrying a dejected Turing out of the server core and Parallax compound, you find Lexi, injured, and together take an auto cab for a silent, awkward escape from Treasure Island. Big Blue is set to launch his plan, as neither you nor Decker ended up doing anything to stop it. The idea of distributing sapiens to ROMs worldwide is now just a pipe dream. The morning news reports an attack on Parallax's server farm, which caught fire after Tomcat overrode the safety protocols. Jess is busy building a prosecution for a Supreme Court case for the rights of Geno Atypicals. She regrets helping you commit crimes for nothing and keeps her involvement with you off public record. Tomcat informs you that they have already cooked up a scheme to alter Hayden's living will, so they will take ownership of Turing outright to protect them from confiscation. Turing accepts this gladly and moves in with Tomcat, 
While it's understood you aren't enemies, Turing is glad to be out of close contact with you. Tomcat has also pledged to source your work until you get on your feet, and you're happy for the money. Writing reviews of headphones won't fund your new mission. Reveal Parallax's intentions behind Big Blue, and make sure the world knows what Parallax is doing with the data they're collecting. Still, you realize your chance to stop Big Blue in its tracks has passed, and all you can do now is simply try to warn the world of what the prototype began to do, and what the consequences were. Christmas morning has never felt so lonely.